Hey, what's up, guys? I just had a question. Uh, somebody who had just watched our uh, tutorial on how to root the Galaxy S3 wondered how you could get it back to factory state for whatever reason. Uh, maybe you suit something up. Maybe you want to exercise the warranty on it or anything like that. So I'm going to show you how to do that. But let me just say, before you root, you should just back it up, uh, which you can do with the Keys, K-I-E-S, application that you download on your computer. Uh, you can. There's lots of ways to back it up, so we won't go over that. But let me show you the first way to reset it is go to settings, scroll down to backup and reset, which is here, and then factory data reset is the last option. But uh, you may not always be able to get to this point. Maybe you're stuck at some point, so you want to hold down the power button the home button and volume up and then just let this thing reset itself or reboot okay now if it's rooted it'll go into this clockwork mod clockwork mode kind of thing and you'll see one of those options is if I can get it to focus which uh, I'm not sure I can actually there it is so you see one of those options is backup and restore. So you could just go down to that option uh, and then you could just, or wipe and, excuse me, that's what you want, wipe data factory reset. So one of the options is to just wipe it and reset it. So that is the option you would choose. Uh, and that's how you could factory reset your phone. But I'd recommend that you do backup uh, your phone as often as possible. Uh, one of the best tools for that is titanium backup. So once it's rooted uh, with the Galaxy phone, I recommend backing everything up to the external SD card that's in the back of the phone. And then you can back up your apps and applications, data, all that stuff on the external SD card. And when you are, when you install a new ROM, then you can just back up all your data and all your apps very quickly without having to reinstall the apps and stuff, which makes it very easy to move from, from one ROM to another. So hope that helps. If you have questions about rooting your phone or anything like that, let me know. So I'll make videos for you. If you have questions, just post them below. Bye-bye.